With their bright yellow shirts that read CSO or Community Service Officer Parks, you can find Kyla Myers and Jennifer Hyder doing outreach with the homeless at different parks around Tucson. They know that we're not out here to harass them or um, bust them, get them for the misdemeanors or anything like that, but they're, we're here to help them and get them off the streets. This duo is part of the Tucson Police Department's Park Safety Team. Since COVID-19, the 10 officers are now partnered with the Sullivan Jackson Shelter Hub to help stop the spread of the virus among the homeless through the COVID-19 housing program. We've been specifically looking for individuals that may have symptoms of COVID-19 or may be susceptible or high risk because of underlying medical conditions. If any person they talk to falls into one of the two categories, officers will place them at either a hotel for high risk isolation or for symptomatic individuals. Jennifer says TPD has accounted for 60% of the more than 200 people in placement. It's been a very popular program. We've been able to get individuals off the street that we've been talking to for months that just didn't want to go to any of the other shelter options. Thank you. I appreciate that. It's not just the officers walking through the parks. This has been a month of collaboration across the city with Sunvan and I Hope Medical Transportation to help those most vulnerable. Most of the time, these people just want someone to talk to, and we're able to do that and create these relationships with these people and just get them the help that they need. Even though the new program was created because of COVID-19, Jennifer thinks that long term this could put more people in permanent housing. Reporting at the Anza Park, Veronica Vernaccio, KGO 9, on your side.